guys, we're down here at uh, Pipe King. Ham's gonna walk us through uh, the shop that they got here, as you guys can see. It's pretty extensive. They got uh, pretty much everything for your smoking needs covered, but he's just gonna kind of give us a quick walkthrough, show us yeah, what's so, in these uh, cases. Out of the 10 cases that we have laid out here, the first case is all of our vape. So we have like pretty much the hottest salt nick vapes that are out on the market, and pretty much Smock is dominating the, as a brand. We have like salt nicks by them and just regular uh, box mods, sticks. All the hottest shit if you guys are into vaping. The second case right here is pretty much going to be our vapes for wax or flour. We also have uh, some up here starting with like the volcano. Everybody knows what the volcano is. That's classic. like the classic, exactly. True vape right there. Uh, we have some other box like style vapes for the desk. We have some portable vapes right here like the Pax, the Da Vinci, which are your more discreet on the go kind of vapes, you know? You got the Puffco uh, up there. The Puffco. Peak. This is like the most hype thing right now. You They're know? still selling like crazy. They're selling like crazy, dude. I'm yeah. surprised to see you guys even have one in. We have a few, so yeah, we keep them on deck. We just like to pretty much give the customers of our local area exactly what they want, you know? Like, this shit's hype. I saw it, man. This is gonna have a lot of hype. We got it, you know? And all stores have it. So we actually use these products, you know? We're not mm -hmm. just like mom and pop shops. We're just sitting behind the desk. Just you point at something, we'll ring you up. We actually know like what we're selling. We use it, we smoke it, you know? So. I mean, I don't know, man. I prefer talking to somebody that knows the product. Mm -hmm. I feel comfortable buying from somebody that knows the product myself, you know? So I feel like everybody else does too. One of the volcanoes. Obviously, when we were growing up, this is this was a staple. Everybody, I remember back in the day, I was like, you haven't gotten high if you haven't smoked out of a volcano. With the big Do ass they still bag? sell? Uh, dude, here and there, here yeah. and there. But, and like, we just keep a, like, them in, in store just to show people, hey, this is like what everything evolved from. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is the classic right it's here. It's kind of a trip, actually. If you go down the line right there, like you're saying, you kind of do see a little bit of the evolution of vaping over the last five or ten years. Yeah. And we like to keep a lot of stuff just for the old the old heads, too, that come in asking for, like, the older brands, you know? Um, Got all your wraps and everything. Yeah, all of our papers, our wraps, like, shout out Raw. Like, I fuck with Raw myself. I like rolling some Raw up. Me, too. Um, we got the papers, we got some backwoods, yeah, we got some backwoods, you know, those are hype right now, too. All of your roll-up needs. Uh, we just started carrying a lot of CBD products, um, that's another hype thing right now. Uh, I think it's not more just hype, it's actually beneficial, I take it, I take a tincture every day. Helps me sleep, manage my anxiety, you know? Mm-hmm. Uh, we got like lollipops, we got candy, we got gel caps. We have like brands like Cushy, which is pretty popular in some uh, dispensaries as well. You guys got the Blazers? I hadn't even seen the red one yet. Yeah, we got the Blazers. They're really popular right now. Um, I love mine. You know, it's like the nicest torch that I think that's in the market right now. We've had the black one for three going on four years now and exactly. it's still running. Exactly, they last forever. Yeah, they last forever. Uh, we got just a bunch of different torches. We got detox, cleaner. We got like everything. Make yeah, everything. <laughs> we just we try to carry some like we want to make it more like convenience store because I feel like people that smoke weed like wanna walk into a store just like they would walk in to buy food or something mm -hmm. like a. Oh, everyday item. I mean, you feel me? Yep. So you gotta carry pretty much everything. Got some more accessories here, some ash catchers, some bowl pieces, slide holders, some, a few of the older style nails. Put your TI in there. Some dry pipes. This is really where the glass kind of starts? Yeah, this is where it starts. So we carry a lot of heavy glass. Uh, it's a local brand. Uh, they're not too far from here. Uh, they've been in the industry for, man, almost like 20 plus years, I would say. Uh, Zob and Heavy are pretty much sister companies. So, you know, Zob is not another brand that's been there for as long as I can remember. We have a lot of heavy. Pretty much this whole wall is just heavy glass, starting from something basic, clear. Uh, like a clear bubble bottom. And this is like an OG shape right here. Has a little splash back next, so you're not gonna get too much water coming up. It's like the Zongs, right? Like the Zongs, exactly. Yeah. Like the OG Zongs. Those are dope. Yeah, I'm gonna hit a Zong in a minute. And then it goes to something like really unique, you know? Like Heavy's known for their little marbles or their little nibs. What's up, G? Yeah, so this is all pretty much Heavy, man. We have something starting at 
every price range pretty much and it just goes up starting wow look at those bubblers get over here this looks like mainly the clear wall yeah mainly the clear wall just scientific and we have something like really basic dude like starting at 30 bucks glass on glass little jammer you know little flower tube for 30 bucks that's like our most basic and we have something in every price range in this kind of style too for 30 these are like 40 bucks i think Oh, 35, my bad. So 35 for the beaker. Quick little hitters, guys. Yep. You're in town, you need a bong. Yeah. Stop by, they got you covered. Exactly. And then from, from there it just goes up, man. We have a bunch of different brands in here. We have some old, old brands. We have some new brands. Black Sheep Gallery. That was my first bong. Really? Boom for lazy. These guys right here? Yeah, it was something like this. Uh, it's like a stemless, you know, and I've never hit a stemless before. I, I think I walked into one of the shops and just got it, dude. I was like, man, I want to grab this. He's still it's doing got, it. like the natural perk there in the bottom. Yeah, huh? it does. Wow. It's like a uh, hollow bottom, so like this whole thing fills up with water. It's kind of a unique hit. Got the Zobs here again. Yep, the Zobs. <clears throat> These are like the OG straights right here. The straight tube. You got the beaker with the little perk. Back. That one right there with the tree perk takes me back. Oh yeah, the OG tree perk. <laughs> wow. Takes me back to like 07 right there. You guys can see a little bit of everything. So that seems like mostly flower rigs over on that wall. Yep, yep. And then down here, it seems like you got more of the clear dab style rigs. Yeah, so everything down here will be dab style rigs exactly for people that want to take dabs instead of the oil, want a smaller piece, less diffusion, you know? So the, uh, I, I prefer less diffusion for my dabs, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't want too much filtration going on. I want to taste what I'm dabbing. I hope you and me both. Yep. And so uh, pretty much everything in these three cases here is pretty much for dabs because, you know, those are way more popular, I would say, than flour. Especially down here. Yeah, especially down here, exactly. And like, I would say, um, these are like a mix. So you could use these for either uh, flour or dabs. They're little hybrid style pieces. Um, they have like unique perks, like the shower head and the zobs. Yeah, I've actually used these for flour before and they work good. These smaller ones probably be pretty good for, for dabs as well. Bunch of monarchs over here. Yeah, a bunch of monarchs over here. We try to, uh, Carry a good variety of that brand. They have pretty much the greatest prices and the quality you can ask for. Uh, and they have pretty much everything, starting from clear to colored. Some more monarchs in here, some sin. Haven't seen sin in a while. Yeah, some OG shit, some leisure, some Mobius, some hoops. I got a hoops, uh, a little tree perk in there. Oh, Dan actually had one of these leisures as an email rig for a while. Yeah. Nice. Inverted ten arm. I don't know if it's the exact ones here. Got the hot sauce rig back there. What you guys do yesterday, man? You just showed an area, or? Yeah. Nice. It's a nice area. What's up with this giant monarch bubbler right here? <laughs> so that's like the hundred millimeter can, um, like Matrix style perk. Yeah, that thing's the uh, called a king bug or something like that. Yeah, it's good so God. it wants to take a fucking huge. I don't experience. think I don't think the viewers are really gonna be able to yeah, grasp the uh, the size of this. Dan, why don't you model that for me? <laughs> <laughs> Man, that's pretty big, dude. You fill this thing up with smoke, you're going down. That'll get if you. If you lit. show up with this thing, you. There's all the other bubblers are going away. <laughs> That'll get you lit. <laughs> yeah. We got uh, over here. This is what the final case we've got here. Yeah, so this is some of our like uh, higher end stuff. Some of our like Toros. We got some Mobius in there. Some old school, just old school style perks, man. I see you got a Santa Cruz recycler back there. Yeah, we got so we got BMFT. Solo piece right there. Got show some love hometown. to the hometown, hometown guy right there. You got some uh, some Fat Boy. Looks like some newer stuff over here. Yep. So that's gonna be like a straight Fab style Fat Boy with a single seed perk in there. This guy's actually CFL, so I think it changes under fluorescent light. Okay. Pretty cool. You got a ball from them too. They're uh, 
really doing some crazy functionals for pretty reasonable prices right yeah, now. Yeah, exactly. And like, man, their quality and craftsmanship on there. Donna's killing really, it. Really like this guy right here. This, uh, what, Illuminati? Yep. I got a torch if you want to. Some UV shots of that guy. Yep, little Illuminati Taurus here. These are cool, man, especially for the price. I mean, look at what is this thing? Probably six inches. Mm -hmm. This particular one is a gem, actually. You guys got some uh, some nails, got some gavels here, the highly educated. We got Adam Reed's pendant, some old school pendants, you know, um, got some quartz, Evan Shore, some troughs. A little bit of everything. That pretty much uh, gives you guys a look at pretty much everything at this location. We still have, uh, we're gonna stop by one of the other shops as well. Show you guys what they got over there. It'll be a little bit of the same, a little bit of some different stuff, but you guys get the idea. It's uh, you know, great all around smoke shop to you know take care of all of your guys' needs. Let them know where, you, where they can find you guys online. Uh, Thepipeking.com, we have a web store. We try to keep pretty much the same inventory uh, online as we do in store. 